So wearing red was very significant. It was for me, yes. Yeah. We were not allowed to wear red growing up. And so after I left, I wanted to send a message to Warren uh, that I knew I wasn't broken. Yeah. You testified 23 times, uh, contributing to the conviction of 11 men, including Warren Jets. What pushed you over that wall finally? What made you climb that wall and run for it? In my life as Ruland Jeff's wife, I experienced a level of violation from a man that was supposed to be God in mortality and, and the incredible amounts of sexual violation that no God of any deity would, would sanction. And it was tremendously traumatizing for me. So when I was being forced to be remarried after Ruland Jeffs died, I'd had enough. That was the last straw for me. And I figured I might go to hell but at least I chose it. I cannot stay and do what I'm being asked to do. You were never taught about sex or anything of that nature, and then you're married. For me to go from being schooled my whole life that it was shameful to be touched, then to have this man, this old man, trying to touch me in intimate ways, not only was it terrifying, but it was horrifying to have this man that could have been my grandfather doing this and being confused and wondering, what is going on? Isn't this bad? My parents never told me about this. And you know your father says that you were thrilled about this and that you're just saying now that you didn't want to do it. I think this is a really good example of part of what happens in a close society and especially in a society like this. There is a level of detachment between the parents and the children. My father had 25 children. My mother had 14 children. We were his secret in the basement. He did not advertise to the world that he had a second family. And he was gone a lot. And so the, my father, we did not interact. And I certainly did not feel safe to go to him with my problems. I knew very well what was expected of me as an FLDS girl. And when I did have conversations with him, he told me that my salvation would be made sure and that it was such a great blessing.